The modules that I teach here are a first year module on the history of early medieval Europe, which goes from about 500 to 1100. And it's designed to give students, who, most of whom have never studied medieval history before, an introduction to some of the key events and themes. In the second year, if students have enjoyed the first year module, they can then go on and do a module of the history of the Crusades. And it can seem a very challenging topic because so many of the sources that we take for granted in modern history, like photographs and diaries and so on, we just don't have for the Middle Ages. In the third year, I do a module called History and Myth in the Middle Ages. And it's partly about the way that history was written in the Middle Ages, but it's also about the way that the Middle Ages has been written about after the Middle Ages. So we look at, for example, modern films, we look at television series, and we look at computer games as well. I try to transfer my own passion for the subject by being enthusiastic in the way that I talk about the subject matter. I think one of the, the unique things about the history course at Huddersfield is the emphasis that we place on developing their skills as historians, but also more broadly as people and as potentially employable people as well. Lots of our students do go into, if you like, history careers like teaching or museum work and so on. But the whole point about a history degree is that it can fit you for a very wide range of professions, in fact.